We are in the Institute de Investigação Científica Tropical, State Laboratory from the Science and Technology National System in Portugal. We are an institution with 130 years old. Uh, it's our 130 years anniversary this year. Um, it's spread for several facilities. Here we are in the Oeiras campus, where uh, several groups of work work here in the make their uh, experiments uh, in these facilities. We are dealing mostly with biological sciences, mostly with phytopathology and uh, uh, biotic stresses concerning several kinds of plants, mostly tropical plants. And among those tropical plants, coffee is a good place because uh, let's say 90% of work uh, done here are in fact uh, using coffee for our experiments. Our work here are dealing with mostly with plant-environment interactions and uh, those uh, aspects uh, mostly in climate changes and plant acclimation to climate stresses and limitations, so extreme temperatures, drought, salinity, and using integrate uh, studies and uh, you, you used to say that it's from plant to gene, so plant we can see to gene that something that we believe that is there, it's this kind of studies that believe is uh, quite important, but uh, the action of the gene is the plant itself, so it's, uh, it's a merry-go-round that we have here, so plant to gene and gene back to plant. You have here five of these chambers, 10,000 high-performance walking chambers. Uh, the other institutes are doing other kind of works with plants, of course. Uh, I know that uh, three of them are being used with rice and uh, wheat, so more dedicated to cereals. Coffee, as I told you before, uh, is a plant uh, that gives us the second world most important commodity that loses only for uh, oil. It's 500 million people, so it's a lot of people that uh, is uh, linked to this plant. This uh, equipment is needed here because we need to control environmental factors, variables. Is that why it's so important to us. It's important to us because we want to see which uh, variable of the environment is important in the impact it has in the plant. So more water, less water, more temperature, less temperature. Uh, we can also deal with uh, nutrient uh, experiments here. So high radiance, not so high radiance, and in this case CO2, levels of CO2 that is also under control of these chambers. This is important for every plant that we can use here. For us, it's even more important because tropical plants cannot be uh, grown in the outside, in the field, in our uh, country. Saying by other words, if I don't use these kind of chambers, I will not be able to do my work because I cannot obtain my plants under good conditions in the field. Thank you.